Hi children, what are we doing? We are learning about money. Now, let us do some word problems. Yes, money, word problems. I hope you will enjoy this program. Yes, you like this? Money, counting, buying things. Yes, so we are going to do some word problems in money and I hope you will enjoy it. It's very interesting how you go shopping with mommy and buy things and give the money. Yes, getting balance. Oh, yeah. Here we are going to do money word problem. Let's look at our first problem. Let's read together and work together. Shall we? Good. Robin. It is Robin who is going shopping. Maybe with his mommy. Robin bought a book for rupees 20 and a pen for 10 rupees. So Robin has gone shopping with mommy and she he wanted to buy a book for 10 rupees and he wants to buy a pen which cost 10 rupees. Okay, now the question is how much money did he spend in all? Two items he bought. What is the total amount? That's what we are asking. How much? Okay. <coughs> what is the cost of the book? 20 rupees. So we write here 20. Plus, what is the cost of the pen? 10 rupees. So we write plus 10 rupees. Now they are asking how much money did he spend in all. So we have to add these two together and find the total amount spent by Robin. <coughs> First, we go to the ones place. This is 10th place. Ones place, we have two zeros. Zero plus zero is zero. Then you go to the tenth place. Two plus one is three. So, we write number three here. How much money did Robin spend in all? Robin spent rupees 30 in all. How much money he spent? 30 rupees. Robin spent rupees 30 rupees. So, mommy gives him Robin 30 rupees from the purse. What is the cost of the book? 20 rupees. What is the cost of the pen? 10 rupees. 20 plus 10? 30. Robin spent 30 rupees to buy a book and a pen. Did you enjoy the problem? Isn't it interesting and easy? Good. Shall we take another word problem? Read together. Shall we? Come. Read along with me. Mohan is going shopping with his dad. What does Mohan want to buy? Let's look. Mohan bought a ball for rupees 12 and a bat for rupees 55. So now Mohan is telling daddy, look dad, I like to buy a ball which is 12 rupees and a bat which is 55 rupees. Let's look at the question. What is the amount Mohan spent? He has to ask daddy for the amount spent, isn't it? Now, what is the cost of a ball? Rupees 12. So we write it here, 12 rupees. 1 and 2, 12. Good. What is the cost of a bat? It's 55 rupees. So we write plus 55. All right? So we have one place and this is the tenth place. Now what are we going to do? What is the amount Mohan spent? Mohan need to know the total. Ask daddy, take and give it to the shopkeeper. Yes, let's add and find out the amount Mohan spent in the shop. Two, we go to the ones place first and add the ones. Two ones and five ones. Two plus five. What is 2 plus 5 or 5 plus 2? Certainly 7. So we write the 7 here. Then we go to the tens place. 1 plus 5 or 5 plus 1 is 6. So we write the 6 here. What is the amount Mohan spent? Mohan spent 67 rupees for a cost of a ball and a bat. Mohan spent 
67 rupees. What is the amount Mohan spent? Mohan spent rupees 67 or 67 rupees. Yes, did you enjoy the problem? Did you like shopping, going shopping with Mohan? So Mohan tell dad, please give me 67 and dad gives him 67 rupees and he gives the shopkeeper. Mohan spent 67 rupees for a bat and a ball. Let's go more shopping. Come along, let's take another problem. Who is going shopping now? <coughs> Mary is shopping with her mama. Mary would like to buy some things for herself. Let's find out what. Mary bought a doll for rupees 25 and some flowers for 30 rupees. 25 rupees for a doll and 30 rupees for some flowers. The question, how much money did she spend totally? Mary is going shopping with mommy. She wants some doll, one doll and some flowers. Now she has to find out the total amount for mommy. Ask mommy to pay the shopkeeper. <coughs> what is the cost of a doll? Rupees 25. So we write here 2 and 5, 25. Okay? Under rupees, you write the cost of a doll is 25 rupees. We put it down ones and tens column. Good. Flowers. What is the cost of the flowers? 30 rupees plus 3 and 0, 30. That's the cost of the flowers. <coughs> So we write here 30, 25 rupees for the doll, 30 rupees for the flowers, 3 and 0, 30. Good. The question is, how much money did Mary spend totally? To find out that we need to add this. Only then Mary can ask mommy to pay the bill. Okay, let's go to the ones place, add 5 plus 0, what is 5 plus 0? Good. 5. 5 plus 0 is 5. So we write the 5 here. Now we go to the tens place. 2 tens plus 3 tens. 3 plus 2 or 2 plus 3 is 5. So we write the 5 here. <coughs> How much money did Mary spend totally? Mary spent totally 55 rupees to buy a doll and some flowers. So your answer is Mary spent Spent 55 rupees to buy a doll and some flowers. Did you enjoy shopping with Mary? Good. Let's take another word problem and let's go shopping. Shopping with who? Let's look. Now, here is Anne. She would like to go shopping with her mom. What does she want to buy? Let's look. Anne says, Mama, here I bought a cup for rupees 35 rupees and a spoon for 13 rupees and then mommy says okay how much money she spent all together mommy wants to know because she has to give the shopkeeper how much money did Anne spend all together now look you're going to find out the amount she spent on a cup and a spoon okay Anne what is the cost of a cup Anne and then says it is rupees 35. So we put under the rupees 3 and 5, 35 rupees. Then she says, okay, I bought a spoon. What is the cost of the spoon, mamas? The cost of the spoon is 13 rupees. So we put plus 1 and 3, 13. Plus 1 and 3, 13. Now we have arranged in 1s and 10s order. We have to find out. How much and spend all together? Let's see. Okay. Ones place and tens place. Here. What is 5 plus 3? 5 plus 3 is good. 8. 5 plus 3 is 8. Or 3 plus 5 is 8. Let's come to the tens place. 3 plus 1 is? Or 1 plus 3 is? 4. Good. So we write 48. So now... How much money did Anne spend all together? 
and spent 48 rupees for a cup and a spoon. But the total amount spent? She spent and spent 48 rupees for a cup and a spoon. Did you enjoy shopping with Anne? I did. Did you enjoy how to add, how to spend the total amount? Good. Shall we take another problem? Shall we go shopping? Who is shopping today? Here is Geeta. Geeta is going shopping with her mama. Let's see what she bought. She went into a shop and Geeta bought a bowl for rupees 12. Then she bought a duster for rupees 14. So she goes into a shop, she bought a bowl and a duster. And now the question is, how much money did she spend in all? Mommy like to know, because she has to pay the bill. Let's find the total. What is the cost of a bowl? Cost of a bowl is 12 rupees. 1 and 2, 12. What is the cost of a duster? The cost of a duster is 14. So we put plus 1 and 4, 14. Plus 1 and 4, 14. We are supposed to find out how much money Gida spent in all for the duster and for the bowl. Look, we are placed in 1 and 1's and 10's. We have arranged it correctly. Let's go to the 1's place. 2 1's plus 4 1. 4 plus 2 or 2 plus 4 is? Good, 6. 2 and 4, 6. Or 4 and 2 is? 6. Very good. What is 1 plus 1? 1 plus 1 is 2. So, how much did Gita spend for a bowl and a duster? 26 rupees. Rupees 26. How much money did she spend in all? Gita spent rupees 26 in all. Okay, that is the answer. Gita spent rupees 26. Did you enjoy shopping with Gita? Good.